Heinz von Furster was an Austrian-American scientist combining physics and philosophy. Together with Warren McCulloch, Norbert Wiener, John von Neumann, Lawrence J. Fogel, and others, Heinz von Furster was an architect of cybernetics. Biography Von Furster was born in 1911 in Vienna, Austria-Hungary, as Heinz von Forster. He was the grandson of Austrian architect Emil Ritter von Furster. He studied physics at the Technical University of Vienna and at the University of Breslau, where in 1944 he received a Ph.D. in physics. He moved to the USA in 1949 and worked at the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign, where he was a professor of electrical engineering from 1951 to 1975. From 1962 to 1975 he also was Professor of Biophysics and 1958 to 75 Director of the Biological Computer Laboratory. Additionally, in 1956-57 and 1963-64 he was a Guggenheim Fellow. From 1963 to 1965 he was President of the Wenner Grant Foundation for Anthropological Research. He knew well and was in conversation with John von Neumann, Norbert Wiener, Humberto Maturana, Francisco Varela, Gordon Pask, Gregory Bateson, Lawrence J. Fogel and Margaret Mead, among many others. He influenced generations of students as a teacher and inclusive, enthusiastic collaborator. Work Von Furster was influenced by the Vienna Circle and Ludwig Wittgenstein. He worked in the field of cybernetics and is known as the inventor of second-order cybernetics. He made important contributions to constructivism. He is also known for his interest in computer music and magic. The Electron Tube Laboratory In 1949 von Furster started work at the University of Illinois Urbana-Champaign at the Electron Tube Laboratory of the Electrical Engineering Department, where he succeeded Joseph Tychosinski Tychosina. With his students he developed many innovative devices, including ultra-high-frequency electronics. He also worked on mathematical models of population dynamics and developed a general model now called the von Furster Equation. Biological Computer Laboratory In 1958 he formed the Biological Computer Lab, studying similarities in cybernetic systems in biology and electronics. Macy Conferences He was the youngest member of the core group of the Macy Conferences on Cybernetics and editor of the five volumes of Cybernetics, a series of conference transcripts that represent important foundational conversations in the field. It was von Furster who suggested that Wiener's coinage, Cybernetics, be applied to this conference series which had previously been called circular causal and feedback mechanisms in biological and social systems. Doomsday Equation A 1960 issue of Science magazine included an article by von Furster and his colleagues P. M. Mora Randall, W. Amiot proposing a formula representing a best fit to available historical data on world population. The authors then predicted future population growth on the basis of this formula. The formula gave 2.7 billion as the 1960 world population and predicted that population growth would become infinite by Friday, November 13, 2026 von Furster's 115th birthday anniversary, a prediction that earned it the name, the Doomsday Equation, based on population data obtained from various sources. Von Furster and his students concluded that world population growth over the centuries was faster than an exponential. In such a situation, doubling time decreases over time. Von Furster's tongue-in-cheek prediction of doomsday on November 13, 2026, was based on an extrapolation into the future of doubling time, with the finding that doubling time would decrease to zero on that date. Responders to his doomsday prediction objected on the grounds of the finite human gestation time of nine months. 
and the transparent fact that biological systems rarely persist in exponential growth for any substantial length of time. Those who knew von Furster could see in his rejoinders an evident sense of humor. Doomsday Equation Recent research Recent research has confirmed the basic soundness of von Furster's findings. The hyperbolic growth of the world population observed until the 1970s has recently been correlated to a non-linear second-order positive feedback between demographic growth and technological development that can be spelled out as follows. Technological growth implies an increase in carrying capacity, an increase in the number of people who can survive on any given plot of land. Demographic growth implies more potential inventors and hence an acceleration of technological growth. Accelerating technological growth causes accelerating growth of carrying capacity, in a positive feedback loop. Faster population growth likewise feeds back by accelerating growth of the number of potential inventors, and then even faster technological growth. Hence, even faster growth of the Earth's carrying capacity for people, and so on. Publications Von Furster authored more than 100 publications. Books A Selection 1949 Cybernetics Transactions of the Sixth Conference Josiah Macy Jr. Foundation New York 220 pp 2002 Understanding Understanding A volume of on Furster's papers published by Springer Furlog 2002 2010 with Monica Broecker Part of the World Fractals of Ethics A Drama in 3 Acts Heinz von Furster's most extensive biography First published in German in 2002, with Monica Broecker, Teil der Welt, Fraktaliner Ethik, Ein Drama in Dre Acton, Articles, A Selection, 1958, Basic Concepts of Homeostasis, in, Homeostatic Mechanisms, Upton, New York, pp. 216-242, 1958. 1960, Doomsday, Friday, November 13, A.D. 2026, with P. M. Morundell, W. Ami Ott, Science 132, pp. 1291-1295, 1960. 1961, A Predictive Model for Self-Organizing Systems, Part 1, Cybernetic of 3, pp. 258 to 300 part 2 cybernetica 4 pp 20 to 55 with gordon pask 1961 1964 biological computers with w ross ashby in bioastronautics e schaefer macmillan co new york pp 333 to 360 1964 1969 what is memory that it may have hindsight and foresight 1971 computing in the semantic domain 1971 technology what will it mean to librarians 